Valentine is coming. Valentine is coming. Hey. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to a new vlog. It's your girl Penny, aka Zayna. That's me. Welcome back. We're on week five of vlogging. Woo! Look at me with consistency. I, guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. And make sure you like, comment, and share. Cause you know, your girl has to get big. I'm coming to you a bit crazy today because I'm washing my hair. It's Sunday. Um, the week before um, Valentine's, I have decided to basically do on my Instagram. If you guys follow me on Instagram, make sure you do. It's Peggy Z Lane. Um, on my Instagram, show seven reasons why God loves you. <laughs> or you should love God. I don't know, but it's going to be seven reasons. And today is God's love is sufficient. So I'm going to be putting that on my Instagram. Um, obviously, some people are always not in a relationship. In this quarantine, it's hard to date. Listen, listen, believe it, I know, because I tried and I failed. But we're gonna pick ourselves up, and we've got God's love. Like, God's love is full. Like, it's everything. As we said, it's sufficient. So we're gonna continue with that. And um, right now, I'm washing my hair before I start church. I am running late. I'm just combing it out. Um, I'm gonna be looking cute this week. Gotta look for cute for God. <laughs> even though, even though I look a hot mess. So yeah, we're on week five. I'm so happy. Look at me getting consistent with YouTube, guys. I appreciate all the love. I appreciate all the likes and comment. Just help me push it out there. You know, if you want to see more things, let me know. Um, I'm going to try my best to not forget the camera this week because sometimes I just forget the camera and I don't even understand how but when I'm packing my bag I take my bag I unpack my bag and then pack my bag again which is silly I know but hey so tune into week five vlog and um, the week of God's love it's not every day take us your spouse love and whatever because God's love is sufficient so love you guys What this day looks like. Let me get out of my area. Guys. Uh, ah, I almost slipped on my ass. I almost slipped on my ass. Good morning. Monday morning. I almost slipped on my ass. Ah, oh my goodness. You know what? I blocked myself out this morning. I almost slipped on my ass. What else can we say? It's snowing. Great. Oh, well, I can't see from the left side. You know what? I can't come and kill myself. No cyclist can drive next to me. I put snow in my car. Oh, and it's swayed. Oh, you know what? I really can't come and die. Oh, I can't believe I almost slipped on my ass. Like, the first thing was that, okay, I locked myself out. So, uh, we've got another key. We've got another key. Okay. De-icer. I finished it for the other day. Can you hear that? I'm moving my car. <laughs> oh god, it hasn't snowed like this in ages. Like it was snowy yesterday, but it wasn't set in as you guys see from the previous footage. This is Monday now, and it's still snowing. So yeah, this is great. Um, <laughs> wait, let me see if I can do something. Nope. Oh my god. That sounded like it was gonna break my window. Jeez, guys. <laughs> Learn from me. Don't do stuff. Don't try out stuff. I almost broke my side window. Yeah, it's scary. 
is actually scary off to the office oh the office is gonna be freezing oh, damn. excuse my language but guys i have to i have to just concentrate on the roads because this right here is is not it I have to go to the shops today to go and buy some de icer. Damn, sis. It never snowed like this before. And when it did, when when it hasn't snowed like this for like three years, I think. Even this is not even that bad. That's the thing. It's more ice. It's do you know what I hate about snow yet? Yeah? When it turns black and icy. But it's not it's not black yet, but it's that ice effect. Oh, I need Batteries dying, guys. I just wanted to snap in the office. So, we've got the team arguing. <laughs> they got, they're arguing about deals. And guys, it's a miserable day. It is freezing. And the snow, yeah. The snow is a lot. Jeez. It hasn't stopped snowing. I told you how long it went this morning. So, this is my outfit today. I just got some Zara trousers. They're slim fit. They're black. And I got these puffer sleeves. I can't remember I got these, where did I got these from. So, white shirt. What do you think? What, I'm vlogging? <laughs> okay, listen. And I told you to stand up. I'll come back. So they're I'm, arguing. I'm a puff finger, little fellas. But unfortunately, this is going to have to be mine. Vince has already told you what the answer is. <laughs> Not tomorrow. fabulous it's still snowing it's 9 a.m it's 9 a.m we are working from home so yes exciting um not really because it's freezing actually in my house it's not cold but it's actually cold outside i mean if this was december and the snow was happening it would be really cute right now right right terrible angles guys i need to work on my angles i'm trying um set some new targets because i need to refocus this is day three so yesterday i don't think i said it to the vlog but i did put it on my instagram so yesterday um god's love is a miracle so today i'm thinking god's love is grace so so his grace i don't know how i'm gonna word it but I have grace on my heart so we're pushing that out like his so if you know what grace is is like it's receiving like la let's say life it's already paid for like imagine i went to the imagine i went shopping and it was already paid for i didn't have to like for no reason that's how grace is like it's already paid for like his grace is so sufficient so we're gonna put that there today on instagram with the cute snow weather and yeah so i hope you're loving these seven days of love i mean god's love is it's what's keeping me right now because to be honest listen i jumped on clubhouse oh mg i clubbed i jumped on clubhouse i don't think that's for me I don't I don't get really good vibes and stuff like that. Um I don't know if I can talk about um uh, my Bible study because they sent me I'm gonna be very transparent, so what is it? They sent me uh, 
They sent me an NDA form. I that both. We're talking about God. It's like Bible study, NDA. Like, obviously, I get people and confidentiality, but I'm not about to get sued. And because they're American, I don't know, because they're American, they, they've they got this suing culture a lot. So, um, in the UK, we just... We know courtesy, but obviously, because it's all around the world and stuff like that, I just don't, um, I just don't know, obviously, the NDA, but they should have called it something else, because it sounds very cult-like, and, oh my god, is my lip dry? It sounds, like, very cult-like, and I'm like, whoa, NDA, I don't feel comfortable signing it, so, I'm talking to the girl that I, um, was introduced to this and stuff like that because I don't feel and they said if you don't sign it you're no longer in the bible study and I was like whoa that's kind of harsh a NDA and like I read through it like I skimmed through it and I was just like okay I get it. like people's um people's information shouldn't be talked about which okay yeah that's fine but then how does testimony works in that sense like how do you how do you share people's testimonies like do you get what i'm saying that's one it's the gospel the gospel is the truth and the light and like the gospel is free <laughs> like that's why people go and evangelize and that's why you guys are evangelizing so that's the second point the third point is like it's just it sounds too weird like it sounds cold, like, like honestly they've been teaching us about the bible and like i won't say a bad thing about them they're really good like it's teaching me like in depth like what like things i didn't know yeah as a believer so um i was just thinking okay but when they sent this nda i was like oh, no 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 Wait, what? NDA? No disclosure agreement? They should have just had an agreement saying so anything because in the UK we've got GDPR. So anyone, if you don't sign or like if you don't agree to it, you cannot put it up. But obviously I don't know how it works in America, so boy. Shout out if anyone's from America, comment down below where you're from. Shout, tell me if this is like a normal thing, like you guys do NDA. Because we don't even sign NDAs to church. So if this is what is weird, like, do you get what I'm saying? Am I just bugging? Or is, it's proper weird, like, you don't sign an NDA to church and you're telling me for Bible study I have to sign an NDA? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. I, it don't sit well with me, so I'm going to have a proper conversation with her because, like, we have our own rules and regulations in the UK, but how, however, it may come across. And I get... Oh, my God, so my phone is ringing. Let me come back to you. It does have, um, it does have a gym. It has a 24-hour gym that you have full access to. Okay, Google. Stop. Guys, I think I need to vent. Oh my god. It's a bit dark. Um, I've got a massive headache, but I just wanted to quickly just jump on here. I was just thinking about um what my friend just said. We was just talking about like I just don't want to give no one my time that is not intentional. And it's like she said that and that just cut deep and it's like, but how do you even know? Like I know people say you know when you know, but to be honest, it feels like you just don't know, <laughs> if you know what I mean, <laughs> lol, like, it's just like, I don't know, if it's just the UK boys, but like, guys just mess around, they just joke, they're like, nah, they're too playful, I think there's just too many options, and I feel like I'm just not that person to give that, give that satisfaction, like, I'm a fucking prize. I am a prize. And like, I'm the biggest asset any man will invest in. So I don't even need your investment because I invest in myself. Like, that's the real. But hey ho, I just had I just had that little snippet to say because I feel better that I've said that out. And good morning guys. It's Thursday. Um apologies, I didn't pick up the camera yesterday. Um, your girl had a rough day. I had a rough day. 
and yeah like i had a rough day at work i want to be very expressive and yeah i had a rough day at work <laughs> i just felt like everyone was targeting me and like trying to diminish my character which we got into the bottom of it never here or there but it was really low yesterday so that pissed me off Hi, there was lows there was also ups so I got a deal, sold two units, so that was great. Um, I would have loved to got that on camera, but the way the atmosphere and everything is, I was just my energy was just not there. It just made me think again about my life, and you know when like certain things happen, it just makes you think, where do I belong here? Because this is it. This is not it for me. Like. It's just like sometimes you have to be a sheep, yeah. Like you have to allow someone to shepherd you to be the sheep. Like it's not always you're the shepherd. Sometimes you have to learn from the basics. But I wasn't even learning and stuff like that. But when something is ta attacking your character, I, s I feel like it's hard. It's really hard to think of God at those moments. But you're just thinking anger, like with me, anger boils up and if I, I find it really hard to express, or uh, let me say not express, I find it really hard to articulate myself without becoming, without being rude. And that's why I tend to not say anything and then when I don't say anything, I hold it back and then like, I'm holding it back, holding it back and then it's like, I know it's anger because it's just tears running from the side and you know you just don't want to cry because it looks like you're weak but you're not weak you're not like I was just like it's all right to cry it is all right to cry sometimes because baby just to round it up I can be very um emotional so I, I cry for everything like I'm a cry baby I'll cry on a um movie I will cry on like if I see someone else crying like that I care about like if I saw them crying I'll be crying next to them hugging them and be like it's okay <laughs> but like yeah so I'm a person that wears my, like I have a lot of emotions but when you don't want the emotions to come out it comes out I think it was very a very weak thing but I'm trying to embrace it it's um day oh yesterday let me tell you yesterday's day was god's love is um god's love is god's love is healed and he's a healer so whoops i just wanted that was yesterday that was thursday and today is god's love is faithful so guys enjoy i hope you're enjoying your love week um remember love comes from god this is a lot for today get a fabulous you know so let me just turn it around i've got woo, we have to go to the car we have to go to quick fit change our tires look how high this is why do i do this to myself i like it whatever so this is what we're wearing we just wear some black trails is from where is this from again I'm not wearing a bra, but it doesn't matter. Um, from Zara. I forgot. Yeah, this is the Elise hoodie. ASOS finest. You know the puffer jacket vibes. Hat H and M, old school. But you know, keep you warm. What trainer should we wear? Help me pick. Oh, let's go for the white. Let's give us a little height. Look at all these containers. I have like a lot of containers, so I'm gonna give it to my mum. Yes! So we are going quick fit because I need to sort my car out. It's a brand new car and I got a flat tire. What's wrong with me? So I've got that and um no. Oh do I have to? <gasps> I'm gonna turn up. I do not care. I don't give it an egg. That was my sister on the phone. So yeah, I'm going quick for it to fix that. And then I might be going full shopping, but I don't know, cause I'm still working. Um, but yeah, guys.
Guys, I love the bed in my office. <laughs> I just want to say happy. Thank you, Claudia. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Valentine is coming to Valentine. I feel spoiled. <laughs> guys, guys, I just reached to the office and they. I look a mess. I've just come back to the office and look. It's Valentine. It's Valentine. So I just got. <laughs> <laughs> this is the first present I received. And this is the second. <laughs> Love is beautiful. <laughs> Love is beautiful. Yeah, look at the arrangement. Oh God. <laughs> My colleague Claudia, say hi to the vlog, Claudia. Claudius. <laughs> okay, hi to my colleague. Say hi. Hi, everyone. Yeah, so. Where's this going, by the way? YouTube. Huh? <laughs> you what? <laughs> this better be going to your phone. You phone. Yeah, so we're going to Mercedes Benz in Croydon. They like to tell us be rude. I don't really like Mercedes. Anyway, I've already expressed that, so we're not going to talk about that again. Um, well, this has got a view in Croydon. I would love to show you that property, but it's too oh, many people. They want to see me on a viewing? No. See how to close. I can teach them how to close, you know. A, B, C, always be closing. <laughs> That's our motto. If you know, you know. A, B, C, always be closing. Um, so, yeah, we're in Clapham now. This is Clapham Common Park. It's not looking the greatest, it's still freezing outside. Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do while driving, scenic, and yeah, we'll catch up with you. Obviously, it's Valentine's weekend, we've got a busy weekend Valentine on Saturday. Is Valentine is coming. Hey, 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 Valentine is coming. Valentine is coming. Hey, where's your? Where's your? My boyfriend, there's no boyfriend, so you know. Life is sweet, but where's he? It's coming, isn't it? It's coming in yeah. the name of Jesus. Amen. So yeah, it's like he might get lost, but he'll come. <laughs> he'll come eventually. <laughs> he'll come, isn't it? Tell the He might get lost, but he'll come. He's obviously stumbling in, on he's his way. He's about to die. He's looking for ways. <laughs> <laughs> he's about to put his ways up. He's coming. He's coming. I've got flowers today. I'll show you. I'll do a little haul of what we got for Valentine's. And yeah. Listen, you've got more than some people that have a wife. <laughs> Some wives haven't even got that. Some girlfriends haven't even got that. So, Valentine is what you make it. It's actually what you make it. And yeah, uh, we'll see you. We'll catch up with you later. Toodles. Guys, I'm back home. Okay. Guys, I'm back home. Woo! What a day it's been. Makina's left and she left it. Well, she, she left this morning. Well, this afternoon. I didn't even get, today's been manic. So today's Friday before Valentine's. Oh my God, I haven't put today's word up today. I'm gonna to think about that while I'm talking to you. So I just wanted to show you my gifts that I got from my colleagues. Don't worry, they receive stuff as well, the men anyway. So first we start off with the lovely red roses, which is so cute. And then, this is from Joe. I got these two for one person. This was from Joe. Guys, I got this from another person. It is, don't forget the Prosecco, because we love a good 
pink rose prosecco so let me just show you got some pink rose prosecco with these lovely hearts they're white chocolate and then a box of chocolate guys this was so good oh from truffle with love <laughs> how cute that was i was spoiled this year i was spoiled then we got <laughs> a box it's got chocolates inside I don't know if you can see it, but it's got chocolates and it's just got flowers, pink roses. Ah! Ah! The men all told us today that, because all the women got the same thing, that, what's it called? This was from Claudius, you know the gentleman that was speaking earlier. Oh, we're not saying his name, but you know. Oh, it's even got a little hairband. What's it called? This is the most that their girlfriends will probably even get. So, oh, oh wives, actually wives, because it's all wives. So they're like, oh, well there's three of you. They don't have three yet, they don't have the luxury. So we've got this, oh, this is so cute. This is, and it's a pop. Is it a pop? It's a plant pop. Oh, this is adorable. You know what, being single is not that bad. Because I know when I start having a relationship, all of this is gold stuff. Why oh, is a proper plant pot? This is amazing. This is amazing. Guys, yeah, you know when I get a boyfriend, all of this is gonna stop. When I get a partner, trust me, I know it, it's gonna stop. There was only one person that usually comes in, our director, he usually comes and gives us a gift as well, but he's quarantining. So that was sweet. So I came home to a lovely, nice, clean home. I just wanted to show you, I've got some new plates from Donnell. I've been looking for some dip dye paint um, plates, dip dye. So like some stoneware, but I want it half and half stone. And I can't find it nowhere. And if I do, it's really expensive. It's like 98 pound for one plate. So today I said I was settle. I was gonna get black plates, but then I thought mm, that's too played out. And then I saw some really nice ones from Next, but my sister said there's no point because when you move, you can get something nicer when you get your bigger place. And I was like, true, but then I have to treat this place as a good home. I just want to show you while I open it. It's busted baby it's, it's not looking great at all so it's so busted my cleaner did an amazing job this cleaner has never been to my house before and everyone loves her and i see why they always ask for her if you want penny cleaners shout out maria this does not look like the brown this is not what i want this is not this is gray <gasps> um, I'm sad. I think I'm gonna return this. Yeah, I think I'm gonna return this because grey is so played out. Sorry. Sorry. See, I should have just ordered the plates over there. Never settle, guys. Just never settle. See, now I've got something I don't want. That's annoying. I wanted us to eat on these nice plates, but. Tomorrow, I'm gonna to be vlogging to our Valentine's evening, me and my sisters. So, we're gonna enjoy. I am going to chillax and relax. Uh, should I have my champagne? My rose champagne tonight. Now, I'm gonna to save it to tomorrow. So, I got the Moscato, I got the rose champagne. So, yeah. Look at the cute roses I got my sisters. They're not going to see this until I've got all my friends. Woo. I've got all my friends and family that I could. Bearing in mind, I've got a lot of friends. Like a special little subject for Valentine's because we are single. Are you meant to put this in water? Girl, baby, I don't even know. Guys. 
right now i'm straightening my hair and i look a mess it's not glued down yet but lordy lord when i washed my hair did it when it was dry i didn't do anything to it and now it's just a bit matted this wig but anyways um it's one o'clock i'm getting ready it's valentine's weekend and and yeah so valentine's weekend me and my sisters are gonna take some cute pictures before we start our galentines you know you know but yeah just wanted to say hi saturday saturday uh, the sun has been beaming all day but i just spoke to my colleague and he said it is freezing so it is cold outside it's a lovely time to go for a walk for for everybody you know anyways i'm gonna keep getting ready and i'll see you in a guys i just finished my makeup in here um, I'm about to take some pictures. My sister's not coming to take pictures, so it's alone. But that's fine. I'm just listening to music for our Valentine's Day. I haven't put lipstick on because you know. So I gotta go. I'm gonna. My hair looks alright. If you know what I did to this hair. See you later. I forgot. I forgot to vlog, guys. Wait, let me get this. The lighting, right? Guys, what do you think of this color on me? It's my sister's hair. I don't know. I would never have my hair like that. Run away. A new relationship with you, this is what you do. Come in. I'm trying to block it out. So, we're still on our day, our Galentine's night. So, Beda is making dessert. We had a linguine prawn pasta, which was amazing. And yeah, I'm trying to. Prawn. What do you think of this hair? This is my sister's hair. I'm not sure. I think it's too light for my complexion. Now we're just waiting for the dessert. But yeah, I'll catch up with you later. Valentine's Day. Today is Valentine's Day. I hope everyone is spreading love to you and everyone else, to your significant others. Today was um, Saturday and I decided to celebrate it with my sisters which was cute. We had spaghetti, no we had linguine prawn pasta. If you follow me on Instagram you would see. Follow your girl. I hope you guys uh, it's in Valentine's Day, so it's Sunday. I just finished watching church, and I've it's not that much to do. Obviously, we're not gonna address the elephant in the room. I just wanted to jump in and say Happy Valentine's Day. I hope you guys are feeling the love, cause it's still love, love. Uh, obviously, we're still in lockdown, so there's nothing we really can do. Um, my colleague showed me love obviously you saw in the previous vlog that they showed me a lot of love and I feel content and loved and I love I am loved by the king so you know you know that's right girl you know that's right little surprise oh it will be out by by this Valentine's will be over by this is out yeah so I just had a little surprise for my friends got friends um some flowers delivered to them like one I did on Friday because also I was like let me do her and then let me do Jenny and then Moya I'm thinking I'll just pay for it because I'm not going out my house so yeah and I hope I'm just waiting for them to receive it you know because like, they're not expecting it it's just like ooh cute 
oh my god just show it like it's not valentine's not always about um what's it called it's not always about your significant other it's about your friends it's about your family showing love god is love so god love can be shown anywhere you know amen sis amen but anyway i'm gonna go and make my breakfast i'll catch up with you later and we'll speak guys omg i just got a knock at the door i haven't opened the card yet all the things i like no wait let me just check who got this for me because i'm just watching dk for youtube dear zaynab sending good vibes to one of our favorite people Thea Hamper, but it doesn't say from who, so I'm not too sure. 